What is up, Cryptocurrency Nation? It's your boy, Riviar. Welcome to the show. Bitcoin has just broken resistance down here. Now let's go and bring this over at 57.743. And it's not looking pretty good for the cryptocurrency markets right now, currently, because the dollar the dollar has been moving up and up and up and up today is is a holiday for banks so i expect that the bitcoin price will move up but let let's see what happens on friday bitcoin needs to break this resistance this resistance right here and this is a pretty big resistance right here. Now, this is good news for traders right here of breaking this. Um, let's go to the hour really quick just to show you how this broke down. And I, I watched it as it broke down. I was like, oh, if I was trading crypto, this would be a pretty good, pretty good moment to get into. During the London session, you can see the breakout. And then you can see the retest on the support line right here. Let's make it closer for you. I can see the retest right there. And it just broke all the way out. This is what you call a breakout candle. And what I think will happen, we will come back and re retest this area right here. And we will continue to go up until Friday. I'm gonna go to the day for Bitcoin really quick. And we're still very uh, bearish in this. And you see this trend line right here is what Bitcoin is going to have to break. So we'll see what happens. Um, but I've been eating up the Forex market because of the dollar has been flying up, as you guys can see. Uh, I talked about this on my channel, this double bounce that happened. And I said I warned everybody in the cryptocurrency market. I said... We're looking like we're trying to form a double bounce and once this formed and this pushed out and the reason this pushed out guys because the feds was saying they were going to start to taper so let's go over here really quick to the news hold on yesterday there was a meeting a federal reserve meeting and these guys talked about hold on let me get over there really quick they talked about a couple of things that interests me um uh, they talked about COVID-19 inflation uh the disruption of uh transportation or moving um objects from country to country and from state to state um they talked about yeah it was the supply chain demand and they talked about how um the other countries were locking down um this economic statement you should read this guys because this is going to tell you what's going to happen with the dollar and how the dollar is going to affect the cryptocurrency markets now news did come out that jerome powell was going to stay in power and let me show you what happened on that news on that day of that news hold on let me go to our because i was watching and planning on the forex market that day we had this huge pump right here and that was on the 24th and let me show you what happened with bitcoin on the 24th bitcoin even pumped with it a little bit because powell was saying that he's not going to uh put down harsh laws against the cryptocurrency market so if you guys watch um the cycles of news especially with the federal reserve you can actually get in a great position to be able to um, make money or trades off of the Federal Reserve news. Okay, so we're gonna be done talking about that. Um, just make sure you guys follow the dollar, the DXY and Bitcoin because Bitcoin controls the whole markets and it is what it is. So let's move on to the biggest game Let's move on to the biggest game in the cryptocurrency nation that is coming out soon. So Alluvium, if you are a PC gamer, this probably would interest you. This is a, what do you call it? A, a 
RPG game where you run around and you collect these Pokemons that are called Alluvium and everything is an NFT. Every single thing is an NFT. The land that this, this land right here is an NFT. Uh, these Alluviums are NFTs. Um, your characters are NFTs. The stuff that they put on the characters are NFTs. It's, it's nuts and crazy. So everything on a game you personally own. And you can go to the blockchain and trade them or sell them. Now, with the land, the land sale should be coming up pretty soon. So follow them on Twitter. I'm trying to get in on the land. I don't even have a PC uh, computer, so I may have to invest in one. But with the land, you put different types of components on there and they mine the resources off of the land and you can add more components to the components you have and mine uh, byproducts or better products off of your land and you sell them to the people who are running around on this game because they need it to give to their alluvial animals to be able to fight and get bigger and bigger and bigger so this is the reason why this is so big is because the people who are making this game, I think they made bat, they made a Batman game and something else. And this is the first time you're going to see incredible graphics, incredible graphics for a cryptocurrency game. And I love what it says, fight for ETH. So let's look at the trailer really quick. And it's just a beautiful thing. Let's go over here real quick and just look at the gameplay. So this is actually the gameplay of the game right here. Nuts right here. Nuts, nuts. And 
there are more videos on YouTube where you can watch where they just show just gameplay and it looks incredible, especially to be on Ethereum blockchain. Um, the coins will be alluvium coins where you can go and trade them on Uniswap or trade them on Coinbase. It'll probably be everyone made every major exchange and you'll be able to make tons of money. So so this is their Discord channel. You guys can go over here to from the website, hit community, hit the Discord. They got Telegram, they got Twitter. So there are more videos on this video game that's coming out pretty soon. Check them out when you can. Um, I think you can buy Illumium right now on Uniswap. Um, it might be a good investment, but if you love content like this, make sure you hit the like button so I can get more subscribers to hear about this great news. And all you guys have a good day and all you guys have a good night and enjoy the crypto life. Peace.